with you a few things that I love. I'm sure that you have some things that you love too. I love coffee. Mmm, it tastes yummy. I also love playing card games with my family and friends. I love it. It's so much fun. I love chocolate. I love chocolate. Do you like chocolate? Or candy? Or gummies? or chips, or lollipops, or ice cream. I, I love, love it. That, me too. You love it too? Yes. I also love coloring books. I love coloring books and crayons and markers because it's so much fun to color. I love it. What do you love, Kelsey? Hmm. Let's see here. Could you like toys or you can dress up? Oh yeah. Animals? Oh yeah, I love all of those things too. And when I think about the things I love, I feel like I cannot go without them. Like I could not imagine not having games to play or chocolate to eat or coffee to drink or coloring <laughs> books to color and the same thing happens to God when he thinks about us because he loves us so much he loves us he loves you so much that when he thinks about a moment without you he's like no 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 I cannot go a day without him I cannot go a day without her you are loved by God and that's why Jesus came to this earth to show us his love so that we could go back to him and be his friends and be with him forever. Jesus loves you so much more than I love chocolate. And that's a big thing to say. Jesus loves you. So say it with me. Jesus loves me. Jesus loves me. You better believe that he does because he cannot imagine a day without you. So think about the thing that you love the most. Maybe it's mom and dad or maybe it is a special toy or maybe it is a special blanket or maybe it is a, a TV show, a cartoon that you enjoy watching. Well, more than you love that thing, God loves you. So today, remember all day long that you are loved by a God who created you perfect and that he thinks about you all the time. I'll see you next time.